Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm gonna be doing a little holiday gift guide slash things that I honestly kind of want for Christmas. I know that a lot of us do tend to procrastinate with presents, so I just kind of whipped this video up. I hope that you guys either get an idea for something that you might want to buy for yourself with any like Christmas money that you get or what to get a family member or just somebody that you know for Christmas. Please don't forget to subscribe down below. Follow me on Instagram. I will have it on the screen as always and also you guys should definitely check out my Pinterest and TikTok. Alright, let's go on and get started with this quick little, well I'll try to make it quick but I don't know how long it's going to last until I edit it, gift guide video slash wish, slash wish list. Let's go. So the first item that I'm going to start off with is the most affordable. It's basically just a little cute trendy mug. This one right here is from Urban Outfitters, but I couldn't find it on the website. I'm not sure if they're just not going to be available from now on or I just don't know what the deal is with that. I did link a very similar one down below that's like the same feel, except the other one does say girl power on it and it is from a different website. It's from like Hot Topic, but the point is you could use literally any mugs. I know that there's some really cute Christmas mugs at Target. I just think that mugs are perfect for that person that just loves coffee. You could even find some that are just more plain and simple for a guy. Prices could honestly range from like $5 to like $7 or $10. I think it's a really smart idea to fill in mugs with either like Starbucks gift cards or little gift cards to go get your nails done. I know for me the older I get the more I love receiving Starbucks gift cards just because those drinks could definitely add up after after you purchase them for a while. So item number two, I definitely recommend for that person that's either going to college or getting their own place. I have this item and I've used it all semester long and I completely love it and it's super affordable. It's literally $10. I have this little pink mini waffle maker. I literally purchased mine off of Amazon. You could get them at Target as well, but Amazon definitely has a bunch more colors and just different options. I've made waffles so many times with like strawberries on the side and with like granola and syrup on top. It's so, so good and so easy to use. I just feel like things like this are so thoughtful. You could order it off of Amazon and literally get it tomorrow if you wanted to, so yeah. These next two items are makeup items. You really can't go wrong with these at all. Every girl should own these at some point, seriously. But it's just the Glossier little lip glosses. I am obsessed with these lip glosses. I currently do have this Halographic one on right now. The original one was the first one I ever tried and it was my favorite. This is literally my second bottle that I've purchased from this one. What I love about these lip glosses is that they're not sticky like other lip glosses. I love the packaging. The best part about these lip glosses is that they're $14 on Glossier's website. I almost forgot to say I just love Glossier like the brand and their purpose and what they're all about so definitely check them out if you haven't already. This next item I don't have but I really want and I might buy it for myself but I will put a picture for you guys like right here it's just the Laneige lip mask I have been wanting this thing for forever all the girls that have it completely just like rave about it on their social media it makes your lips really smooth and plump their pink one is probably like their most popular scent or flavor and the price of that one is actually $20 I thought it was gonna be more expensive but 20 is not that bad I don't know about you you guys but this is something I'm definitely planning on getting for myself these next items I don't have as well but they range from like prices 16 to 24 I will put pictures again but it's just like the card games that urban outfitters sell I know they have like what do you mean they have like that drinking game and they also have the for the girls party game set I'm gonna be the type of person that when I get my own place I am gonna have a box full of these card games under the coffee table so that way I could just pull them out whenever I have visitors over. I honestly definitely want the drinking game. That one seems so fun to play. And I'm going to be 21 in February, even though... Never mind. <laughs> Whoops. 
Okay. That one is the one I really want. I also want the For the Girls game. That one seems really fun to play like with your BFF. And honestly, they're not that expensive. I don't know why I thought these were gonna be like $30 to $40, but they're not. I will have all of the options that I personally want linked down below for you guys so that you guys could just go and check them out for yourself. This next item I do have as well. I got it this past semester and I've been obsessed with it. But it's just this Madewell clear bag. This thing is so cute. Okay, so originally I found this on Pinterest and I was like, oh my gosh, like I need to have it. I feel like it's such a perfect bag for somebody to put either their makeup or their skincare in just because it is like this little plastic clear material so if anything spills all they have to do is just clean it up with a little Clorox wipe or just some type of wipe in general and on top of that it is made well who doesn't love made well although they are really expensive and honestly like I just some of the things are just overly expensive I think overall it is a really good brand and on top of that made well does have a student discount never buy something in made well without using your student discount honestly this one is their bigger size it's around $20 I'm pretty sure they have a small one as well and that one is cheaper for sure but I'm just not too sure in case I do find a small one I will have that one linked down below as well also mine is definitely dirty right now I need to wash it so this next item I don't have but I honestly definitely want it I might buy it for myself sometime soon but it's just a little mini fridge I'll put a picture right here again I've seen these all over Amazon there's so many brands I don't know which one is like the best brand to buy from them personally I want mine to put in my bathroom to put all of like my face masks in there I used to buy a bunch of blush cosmetics face masks but I actually stopped buying them because I would go put them in my refrigerator refrigerator and then I would like eventually forget about them and then they would expire and then I'd be like am I still allowed to use this or not and then I wouldn't use it so I feel like a little fridge like this would help solve that problem I love how they come in so many colors I might get the white one because like I feel like it matches basically any type of room setting the price range is around $45 even if you don't use it for skincare this would be perfect for that person that always has like drinks or things like that in their room I know you could put like sodas in them or refrigerated snacks or anything like that this next item I do have in black it is a clothing piece but I actually want this in white as well so it is the urban outfitter champion crew neck sweatshirt I think these are originally for men but these would definitely work for like that trendy friend that you have that wears oversized sweatshirts kind of like as dresses I know personally I'm that girl that loves wearing oversized sweaters and these are so so comfortable as well I definitely love lived in this for sure last semester just for reference I got mine in an extra large and I feel like that size would work for most people in case you wanted something like really baggy and loose this next item I don't have as well but I do want it really really badly this is the glam glow face mask I want one of these so badly basically it's just a peel off face mask but it has glitter in it this glitter doesn't scratch your skin or get in your pores or anything like that these are a little bit pricier they are $59 for a face mask that is a little reaching the more expensive side but I definitely feel like it's worth it if you're getting it as a gift or just as like a birthday present this is honestly the perfect gift for that friend that loves all things skincare this next item I don't have and I actually don't really want this item as much as the other items that I really really want but if I did have a house I would definitely want this item a lot more it is just a cute little chunky knit blanket honestly your best bet would be to get these off of Amazon but they probably sell them on Etsy as well and I know there might be a few Instagram pages that sell them too but chunky knit blankets were definitely like the trend last year I just never got around to it I feel like these would look so cute on like a couch the reason I said I don't really want this item as much as the other items is just because like I wouldn't know where to put it I don't have my own place right now so I don't really have like a cute couch to put it on or anything like that but when I do move out I feel like this is a classic blanket to have especially during the winter for these blankets though the price does really vary you could find some that are around $60 but then you could find some that are like hundred dollars just really depends on who you purchase it from but I would definitely recommend for you guys to check out Amazon for sure I will have my personal one that I recommend for you guys linked down below this next item is perfect for like that techie person but it's just basically like this instant Polaroid printer I think they came out like last year around this like time of the year it's just basically a little tiny portable printer that prints out pictures that you take on your phone price 
prices do range from around $79 to $100. It just really depends on what brand you buy. And I think you also need to buy the printer paper separately. So definitely make sure you do your research before you buy it just so you know if it's something you could afford. But yeah, so cool. I honestly want one. Probably not gonna get one anytime soon because it's not something I need, but definitely something I want in the future. The lighting is getting worse, so that means I'm gonna start wrapping this video up. The last item is actually the item that I'm getting for Christmas this year. I told my parents I didn't want anything, but they insisted, and honestly, this might be my last present. Next year, I'm 21. Chances are I'm not gonna get any presents once I turn 21 for Christmas. I could totally be just dramatic, and they might give me some eventually once I like move out and stuff but this might be like the last big like gift that I ever received from them but I just got this super cute a dry bar like hair set I am so excited to use this I honestly really needed a new hair straightener just because I've had literally the same one since high school and it just does not work anymore like whatsoever I've just been killing that thing it has like the straightener it has a blowout which honestly I don't even have a blowout and I really have needed one for a while now because in the mornings I work out and then my hair is sweating and I need something to like dry my hair before I iron it and it does come with like their top like three products or something like that I think it's like the dry shampoo this gift is definitely on the pricier side though it is $300 with everything included I definitely felt bad because I don't normally go around asking for gifts that are $300 but it definitely is something I plan on using for years until it dies out like my poor hair straightener that I used this morning from a different brand. I know Dry Bar is a really good brand for hair products and hair care and stuff like that. So I know this is gonna be something I'm gonna use for years down the road. That is actually it for today's little holiday gift guide. I just wanted to say have the best Christmas. Um, remember, it's not about the presents. It's honestly about spending time with your family. The reality is that nobody knows how long they're on earth. Nobody knows how long they're gonna know somebody for. So definitely celebrate it like it's your best one yet. And I also wanted to just take a second to thank you guys for all of the support oh my goodness my memory card died while i was giving my little speech do not forget to subscribe and give this video a huge thumbs up if you found it helpful and if you liked it make sure to comment down below what you asked for for christmas or what you're giving somebody for christmas i will see you guys in my next video i am going to upload um a few more times before the year ends so stay on the lookout for that bye guys bye.